on low class 1 today in computer we'll continue with chapter 5 keyboard and mouse today we'll deal with special keys on page number 41 special keys some keys usually have words written on them some keys usually have words written on them they are used to do some specific tasks these keys are called special keys the keys which they have got words written on them and they have got some specific tasks and these keys are called special keys let us learn more of learn about some special keys colored in green in figure 5 from 5.3 here in figure 5 from 3 you can you can see some special keys that are colored in green you can see some special keys that are colored in green here is the caps lock key your space bar keys here space bar key your enter key your backspace key and here also enter key is there these are special keys these are special keys and now special keys are those keys which has got special tasks to do first we learn about space bar key now here in this figure you can see space bar key here you can see space bar key is here the, this is the longest key on the keyboard the space bar key is the longest key on the keyboard it is used to insert blank spaces between two letters words or numbers the space bar key is used to insert blank spaces between two letters words or numbers next we have got enter key here yeah. here yeah, you can see enter key here yeah. different shapes of enter key look at the different shapes of enter key the enter key is used to move to a new line so when you type enter key is used to move to a new line different keyboards have different shapes of the enter key different keyboards have different shapes of the enter key the most common shape of the enter key are shown in figure 5.5 here in figure 5.5 here you can see the different shapes of enter key a keyboard usually has two enter keys as can be seen in figure 5.3 so the keyboard usually has two enter keys so a keyboard usually has two enter keys there you can see here and here these are the two enter keys a keyboard usually has two enter keys okay now here you should know you should know cursor is the blinking line on the screen it shows the position where the next letter will be typed when you start typing you see a blinking line on the screen it shows the position where the next letter will be typed here you can see the mouse pointer as i am teaching you this subject computer you can see the mouse pointer i am moving the mouse pointer you can see the mouse pointer this is the mouse pointer so cursor will appear when you start typing when you start typing cursor will appear it's a blinking line on the screen it shows the position where the next letter will be typed now next we come to caps lock key now here you can see the image of caps lock key here. you can see the image of caps lock key the caps lock key is used to type capital letters in uh, type alphabets in capital letter the caps lock key is used to type alphabets in capital letter so the caps lock key is used to 
type alphabets in Kepler. You press the caps lock key on and you start typing all the alphabets will appear in capital letter. When the caps lock key is on the type letters will appear in capital letters. So when the caps lock key is on the type letters will appear in capital letters also called uppercase letters. Capital letters are also called uppercase letters. Pressing the caps lock key again will turn it off. When you press the caps lock key once it will be turned on and when you start typing all the letters alphabets will appear in capital letter. But again if you press the caps lock key again and when you start typing all the letters will appear in small letter. The letters type then will appear in small letters as smaller and also called lowercase letters. So small letters are also called lowercase letters. No. No. You should know cap lock key is used to switch between cap letters and small letters while type typing. So caps lock key is used to switch between cap letters and small letters while typing. Most keyboards have a light to show whether the caps lock key is on or off. So most keyboards have light to show whether the caps lock key is on or off. Now next we come to backspace key, another special key. When we make a mistake while typing, we can erase it by pressing the backspace key. So when you make any mistakes while typing, we can erase it by pressing the backspace key. There you can see the image of backspace key here. Now practice time. Find the enter keys in this keyboard color one of them red and the other blue you in this keyboard you find the what you have to find you have to find the enter key you have to find the enter key in this keyboard and after finding one enter enter key you color red and the other you color blue also color the space bar key green you color the space bar key green caps lock key orange and backspace key purple so you do that so with that we come to the end of special keys so special keys are those keys which are used to do some specific tasks and which are the special keys space bar key, enter key, caps lock key and backspace key. These are the special keys.